tonight's ninth race, number one, McDickerson, owned by Randall and Clifford Neal, trainer Randall Neal, driver Anthony Napolitano. Two, Jolton Colt, owned by Michael Medors and Tina Sudermeister, trainer Patrick Medors, driver Joe Pavia, Jr. Three, Fulfilled, owned by Roger Hammer, Mark Ford, trainer Mark Ford, driver George Napolitano, Jr. Four, Night Call, owned by Harmony Oaks Racing, Stable Incorporated, Wiswell and Hanson, trainer John Butenchain, driver Anthony Morgan. Five, Easy Moving, owned by Michael Smalio, James Kohler, and William Robinson, trainer Brian Brown, driver Matt Kikaley. Six, Tough Enough Hanover, owned by William and Barbara Ethier, trainer Scott Blackler, driver Andrew McCarthy. And seven, This Dragon Flies, owned by Anthony Reese, Bernardo Bryan, and Carol Reese, trainer Noel Daly, driver Jim Morrill, Jr. Tonight's ninth race at Pocono, seven, second division of six for the Stallion Series, purse $20,000. And around the turn, they go. The Pacers have reached the back stretch. And they are... Underway. Good start there. Very quick start now from the outside quickly to the lead for easy moving. And he's out by about two and a half lengths in the early going. Inside, Jolton Colt second, followed on the outside by Tough Enough Hanover third, past the eighth mile marker. A close fourth there is fulfilled. Then two more back to McDickerson pacing fifth. Night Call is sixth, and this Dragon Flies is the early trailer. Easy moving, has that lead as they come around the paddock turn. First of three here, gets to the quarter quickly in 27 and one fifth. And Easy Moving, who's been solid of late at the Meadows, has the lead now with Matt Kakali in the bike. Here comes Tough Enough Hanover, five straight on the board. The four to five favorite not going to wake in a challenge easy moving as they approach the clubhouse turn inside third is jolton colt followed there by fulfilled fourth around the turn then it's night call tipping out their fifth inside sixth mcdickerson at the back this dragon flies tough enough hanover clears just as they get to the half mile marker in 55 and 1 28 even second panel and that takeover the lead produced a very hot opening half mile here the lead for tough enough hanover but jolton colt senses blood in the waters goes first over there for Pavian is right up alongside the leader. Meanwhile easy moving still right there in the pocket third. Gapped out fulfilled trying to keep up there fourth inside McDickerson saving ground. At the end now our night call and this dragon flies. Three quarters 123 and 2 28 and 1 third panel the battle rages on here inside tough enough Hanover outside Jolton Colt. Meanwhile easy moving is still there third further back McDickerson and fulfilled at the top of the stretch. It's tough Tough enough hand over McCarthy trying to keep him alive. Outside is Jolton Colt now to the passing lane. Easy moving. Going to make it a three-way dance from way back. Closing is fulfilled, but easy moving. Foot back from the passing lane and gets it done. Fulfilled with second photo for the show between McDickerson and Tough Enough Hanover. Easy moving and Matt Kakali, 152-2. Ladies and gentlemen, judges have posted the unofficial order finished for tonight's ninth race. Number five, easy moving, finished first. Number three, fulfilled, finished second. Number six, tough enough, Hanover, finished third. Unofficially, five, three, six in race number nine. Moving into the winner's circle, unofficial winner of the ninth, second division of the Stallion Series here, the five, easy moving. A three-year-old bay gelding by Western Hanover out of damsel in distress by Arts Place, bred by... B. Michael Timpano of Ontario, Canada, owned by Michael Samalio of Lindhurst, Ohio, James Kohler of Findlay, Ohio, and William Robinson, also of Findlay, Ohio. Brian Brown is the trainer, and Matt Kakali does the driving. Third driving victory of the night for Matt. An easy moving, 5-1, to one, the third choice on the board. We've seen it several times tonight. Uh, first takes the lead early, then uh, goes back to the pocket and fights back from the passing lane. That was the style easy moving used to get the win tonight. Third win in seven tries this year third lifetime victory as well and a new career mark of 152 and two fifths for the five easy moving